figure it out. I'm not moving. Oh, I don't have to do that for him. Oops. Alright, look for famed orc items, chat. We really, really, really want those. Finishes up a couple of our builds. So there's an... Oh, is that a... No, it's a regular axe. QED the Proven. These are really odd. I mean, I wonder what you've chosen for uh, who chose the like the actual list of names because they've been really on on point. I thought there was also a name in addition to the Warlord. Did it change as we engage the group? No, there it is. That is a famed orc shield. Famed orc shield. Color me excited. A renewal. Welcome back. Erinder87. Welcome back. Thanks for the reset. Never win. Does he have other stats too, like his melee defense? Just his HP. Oh, but he's a champion orc. Look at this. He's got 364 HP. No increased and massively increased head armor. But not massively increased body armor. Weird. Thank you, tragic booty. The seven month reso. Cheers. I don't know why he's still fucking alive, but he's still alive. This is a different helmet. Oh, it is. So some of the orcs. That's interesting. Orc gear is different. Didn't know that either. Jorbs appear. Jorbs appear. <laughs> I thought I said Jorbs appear. Jorbs Zephyr, huh? Thanks, Sui. 54 month resub. Much appreciated. Alright, let's see what this guy does. Double attacks on. Oh, because we taunted him. That makes sense, I guess. Right on the archer. It's exciting. Everybody's on the archer. My archers are in a little pocket surrounded by orc warriors. Should get killing frenzy when this guy runs, so let's let him run first. Mm, 
Calric took it. Oh, because of course he's in the better position. The the position is going to attack from there. Makes sense. done. How much is he bleeding for? It's like 10 HP. He's never ever going to die from that. I was hoping that would break. ton of resolve hits over there for us. He's gonna be out of stam next round annoyingly. Can taunt here. He's panicked, right? Oh, we can't throw at him even though he's panicked. Still, it seems like a thing to just move away from him. Could rotate uh, Sifu out. I think that's reasonable. Way you can shoot him in the head and not kill him for no reason. The warlord is fleeing though. to this. Two hits. that famed orc shield we were looking for so that's great i think it's exactly identical to the ones we have the one we have right slightly increased durability i mean okay that was the mission apparently how does it compare to our existing orc shield 98 it's better than our existing orc shield 15 20 well that's the range defense orc shield oh my god what is this fucking amateur hour? Let's get our double orc shields in here. 18 melee defense. Now what, orcs? Now what? Alright, anything else? They have Alps, but they don't actually give a shit about Alps. Fine. Uh, we'll head north. 
We have a couple other contracts we want to check down here. Locations, rather. Uh, how are we on dogs? We did lose a couple dogs, right? We kind of want to replace a few dogs. Like two, maybe. I want the war dogs, not these shitty dogs. The war, the, the, war, the dogs that have been trained from an early age to go for the throat. You know, like the babysitting dogs is what I'm getting at. Uh, another cell sword, pretty unexciting. No. It's pretty rough. That's pretty garbage. What are they buying out here? What do they have for sale to? 226 tools. 57 food. Uh, buying at a number 17. That's an okay number. We need to find more orcs. Oh, and we have the um, don't let me forget the necro savants while we're over here. We've been saving that till we got the second, the second, the last part of the Kraken quest set up, and we've just finished that. So we can now go in and do uh, necro savants, which would be good. And the weaponsmith and armor had nothing, right? Right. And a rondel dagger in there, but mm, gives a shit. Uh, dead people. Overgrown foundations full of treasure not far north. Axes, smash shields. Good talk. That guy's a great conversationalist. One useful to have. All right. 1% um, chance famed items. 1%? Oh my god, we're set. We'll wait till that gets replaced by a mission. Let's head over here. I've been in this area. Let's go to the Necro Savants. It's an undead location, too, for our undead lo ambition. That's not Necro Savants. Necro Savants is north. Oh, we're doing both then. Do a masquerade first. It's still an undead location. All right, 16%. Is this the actual fight? Sure fucking isn't. All right. I don't know that this got harder. It got different. Got more different, sir, sir. I think this is the correct way of saying that. Shawl's still healing, annoyingly. I can't have that hat anymore, Shawl, so give it up. All right. Uh, they're going to attack this guy a little bit. Are we okay with that? Probably. Necro Savants, these are fine. Run one mega in the back. Does not need double undead shields for this, by the way. Or double orc shields. Okay, I don't think I need to change armor up. Let's dive in. Alright. Should not have brought a cleaver, that should have been an axe. I really need to get, this has been our second brother, the number two brother that we trained is this brother here and he's still using shitty weapons. I really hate that. I hate that he's such a high powered brother with a cleaver spec that we took for the mid game and then have never been paid off by an orc cleaver. Feels super bad. It is Calric. It's a really shitty weapon. Why are the honor guard is allowed to move? No stunning. This is our turn. Be annoying seeing we're in fucking double archers. That's the most annoying location he can be in. The archers just both pass their turn too. That's so shitty. God, that's that's so shitty.
Where's my mega? There. Stop being annoying. All right. Yeah, it's kind of like stopping being annoying. See, that's how much damage we lost last round off those guys being shut down for a round like that. Another attack left? Wasn't expecting that if that's the case. This could do okay damage versus them, surprisingly. How much HP do they have? 55. <laughs> Don't block my archers anymore, you understand? Dog, where are you going? There's a guy right there. Fuck that dog. No boo. So inappropriate. Is that a warning shot? How come you give warning shots to all the bandits, but not to, uh... Not to that. I believe she just killed the dog. It was armored too. She one shot our armored dog. Dog we spent all that time investing in armor for. She's like company mascot, dead. Probably done that in the other order if I counted stamina. Where's the cloud centered right there? Sifu trying to steal the kill. Good try, Sifu. I appreciate the effort. A for effort. Not like killing a killing a dog. Maybe I should have executed there. We're gonna miss 95s. Where the fuck that was? Where was that? Yeah, it was definitely a 95. We dare risk killing our own teammates. I mean, no 
I was pretty bloodthirsty. All right, uh, we did get one powder, which we need. No famed items. Some tassels. Okay. Do I get XP for killing your own dog? I don't know. Feels like we probably lost some XP. I mean, where was that? That was on Sifu. It was, she killed Sifu's dog. That's so petty. Killed his dog. Okay, uh, let's move. Do we want to check down here real quick? We need to kill four undead. And we're going up north. I guess we could check real quick. We haven't been to this. It's bus fog. Yeah, we do need food. It's not going to be food in this location. We could just get all four undead locations taken care of in like two seconds, though, and get another ambition, which seems reasonable. All right, I mean, this is going to be the world's dumbest fight. It's okay. Is this 32 uh, zombies right now? <laughs> A lot of zombies. Okay, there's no art. There's no um, necros or geist, though. It's just a shit ton of zombies. Zombies and the champion. Fallen hero, you mean? Fallen heroes are not champions. Fallen heroes are walking sources of armor. Who are only dangerous with necro buffs. They're very dangerous with necro buffs, but they're not dangerous without them. Not except the very, very early game. I should have set up the AoE a little bit better, is the only thing I should have done. I think some round swings in this fight would have been enjoyable. I guess there could be a necro north. Let's begin living the dream. Yeah, we've been, we've been avoiding this, um, this location all game because there's almost no value in going in here there's no no loot or anything like that we're only doing it because we have the undead ambition so clearing that out makes sense the synchronized moaning always makes me crack up speed mod doing work here Twenty-one zombies alive. I feel like I've killed like a thousand. Uh, 
Yeah, this is uh, the their billions campaign mode. Our mega gets hit so much, man. I seem to remember he was on the replacement block. So what's going on with homie drop up there? He's gonna panic off zombie spawns. Like he's killing two zombies a turn and his morale is going down. I mean, I guess killing two zombies a turn, but it actually means you get rolled on twice per turn because there's now two locations for zombies to go, but. Seems kind of like it shouldn't be exactly that. Dude, what? Well, big head hit off this, uh... Not this zombie here. You know what the number one thing I hate about these thrower archers is, chat? I hate that I don't get to take advantage of quick hands with an extra ammo pack. Out of stamina. Sure. Problem is, what do you dump for bags and belts? You can't. There's no more. There's no more perk points available on these archers. So, like you can start. You start messing around with things like bullseye or recover. Those are the next points that you can potentially remove, but you can't really remove bullseye or recover. Okay, almost done with these zombies, I think. No uh, friendly fire shots and dogs, so we're good. Stamina, Sifu. Okay. I guess we're not saving his armor. Which is fine. We don't really have a use for zombie armor at this stage, but part of me just 
Feels like we ought to be. Hardest camp of our life, for sure. Got a zombie hat. Okay. Trip went very well, Mortifier. Thank you. Yeah, we're back up. Just for a little bit today, unfortunately. Just for today. Out of town again tomorrow. I hate leaving stream this long, by the way. It makes me feel super bad. 10% chance on this one. We need four. We're going to do that one and that one. I guess we might as well. How are we on food? A little bit of food. All right. I guess I should do things like, you know, make sure my armor's not all broken up. <sighs> Small annoying things like that. Did someone, someone else get hit in the head too? No, not really. All right, uh, I'll be right back, chat. Take this fight. Back in a sec. Right, I hear zombies. And those are guys and a necro. So this is a much nastier camp. It's annoying we're doing it at nighttime fighting the fucking necro. Probably gonna end up just brute forcing it, which is fine. We will get yelled at by Geist on turn one with this positioning. This is aggressive necro killing positioning. Except we can't kill necros with the fob. Double uh, axes are a little bit scary. Might even relieve some pressure up that way, we'll see. Even not yelling this turn, thankfully. They're in range to yell, though. Any legendary locations we clear? Not today. Not yet. Where'd the fucking Necro go? Wait, where is he? Out of range, I gotta move these guys forward. All right, well, that's the thing we gotta do now.
That one I can't get to because of the bush, though. It's annoying. I don't know where I want this guy to go. I don't think he's necessary down south. Double misses. no whip. Where's my whip? There. Can we see him from there? Yes. Shooting at night time. Feels bad. <laughs> nice Nobu. Alright, rip, rip Necro. All right, so this needs to be a rally. And we want to dump on that guy. I need the pike to hit that one so we can one-shot it with the axe. It's really annoying that missed. Oh, he's hidden. They're both hidden? Wow, that was bad. Still on my archer now. attack that geist. Can he even see? Is that the issue? Is it range? No, sight's three. Quitters never win. Okay. Back certain navy issue. Ten month resub. Thank you very much.
getting our archer. That's all he misses. Too bad. Would have nice to say, uh, protect Nobu a little bit there. I guess her life could be in the hands of Sifu. That seems reasonable. Surprisingly, Sifu let it live. Shocked. Hopefully not addressing what? Explain why it should go nimble or battle forge. Specific criteria. Yeah, dude, stats. It's always the answer to all those questions is always stats. Your goal when finding brothers is to match the appropriate stats with the appropriate builds. And for uh, Nimble and Battle Forge, it's just stamina and HP are the two things you're looking at. I think we can rotate in there and start swinging. So lots of stamina is a Battle Forge build. It has more total effective HP. There's some slight like minutia with that. Like certain enemies are better to have uh, Battle Forge versus uh, Nimble and vice versa. Any enemies with really high armor pen, the Nimble is better. For example, uh, Marksman. Crossbow Marksman, you don't even really give a shit with uh, Nimble. And you care a lot if you're uh, Battle Forge because you'll take wounds. But in general, you get more HP out of the Battle Forge. The late game Battle Forge gear, I think is a little bit more accessible too. So having some of those in a reasonable time frame can be good. What? Why is this thing here? Why are you here? It's not a place for you. Also not a place for you. Almost through this camp. Or at least getting there anyways. here this turn looks good all right more garbage don't care we have one more camp to bus 